The British Museum, London, one of the oldest museums on Earth. By day, visitors come to see the treasures within, but by night, it's a different story. children approaching. They're here. Welcome to the British Museum. You are about to begin an incredible journey through the darkened, night-filled galleries of this great building. I'm Agatha, your tour guide, but I'm no ordinary tour guide. No, I'm quite extraordinary, if anything. Uh, that's because I'm dead. Shocked? Yes, well, you soon will be. Now, I'm looking for three more guardians for the museum. Are you up for the challenge of your lives? Yes. Jolly good, but who do we have here? What are your names? David. Harry. Ryan. And where have you come from? Colchester. Well, you must be wondering why you've been summoned here in the middle of the night. Listen carefully. You have just one night to discover the secrets and mysteries of a relic held deep within these walls. You will face three challenges. Each challenge will unlock a vision about your relic. Pass a challenge and you will all see the vision. Fail and the vision will be revealed to just one of you and you will have only their memory to rely on. Your knowledge of the three visions will be tested in the final battle when you come face to face with the Dark Lord. Succeed and you will become guardians of the museum and receive the golden scarab. Fail and you will become relics yourselves and part of the museum forever. Agatha! Oh no! That's the Dark Lord! He knows you're here and he'll be sending his dark forces to seek you out. We're not safe here any longer, chaps. It's time for your first challenge. Follow me! Run! Run as fast as you can, children! My dark forces are coming, and they will seek you out! <laughs> are we all present and correct? Yep! Right, well, consider yourselves lucky. Not every journey through the museum will be as easy, I can assure you. Now, to learn about your relic, you must first unlock a vision. And to do that, you must complete a challenge. Now, your first challenge takes place in the ancient world that created many of these strange and beautiful objects. We are off to the land of the Aztecs. So, gather round, chaps. Follow my instructions. Hold on nice and tight. Quick clip, quick clip. Are you ready? Yep. Jolly good. Off we go. Goodness me, that was a windy one. Yeah. Right. Have you ever time travelled before? No. no. It's exciting, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> right, we are in the pyramid of Tenochtitlan, absolutely one of my favourite holiday destinations. Unfortunately, it's been ransacked by Hernan Cortes and his Spanish army. They've taken all the treasure. In fact, the only treasure that remains is on the other side of that wall. And that is your first challenge, to retrieve it. You're looking for five pieces of turquoise. Just like this. Isn't it beautiful? Yeah. yeah. First of all, you are going to dive through here. You have to find some turquoise in that room. When you found it, you place it in this wagon for your teammates to retrieve. Then, you do a big roll underneath this wall. Mind you, you don't squash your head on the way. At the end of 90 seconds, you have to have all five pieces of turquoise and all three team members back on this side of the wall in order to pass. Okay. If you pass, all three of you can see the vision. Yes. Now, if you don't pass, I'm afraid only one of you can see That's the vision. Bad. OK? Do you think you can do it? Yeah. I think you can do it. Now, who's going to go first? Me. You're going to go first? Yeah. Jolly good. Come on this way. OK, David, hope you're ready. Yep. OK, you can go in three, two, one, go! Go on, David! That's it. Give me some encouragement. No one Look for that turquoise. Tell us when you found it. If you've got a piece, put it in the wagon. Quick, 
Arrangement. So, like so, put your angles together, stand the arms straight. I'm going to say a rhyme, you just do as I say. Very simple. So, secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in, hold on tight, close your eyes, and see. The vision begins. Ancient China, over a thousand years ago. An old man, he's writing something. The story of his life. He was once a general of a great army. I'm getting the name Liu Ting Shu. I sense many years have passed, and he is preparing for death. His tomb must be filled with everything his soul needs for his journey to the spirit world. We're leaving. We're coming back to the museum. Back to the museum. Back to the museum. Okay. So, we've all seen the first vision. So what can you remember, chaps? Um, it was a thousand years ago. It was in ancient China. The man was called Liu Ting Shu. Who was this chap? He was a leader of a Chin Chinese army, I think. Ah, good. And he was preparing for death, writing his about his life. What do you think the relic is? I'm not sure yet, because... We haven't seen. No, that. good point. Well, maybe it will become clearer in the next two visions. In the meantime, remember everything that you've seen, chaps. It will come in very handy when you meet the Dark Lord. <gasps> Did you hear something? That was the Dark Forces. They're closing in. We're not safe here any longer, chaps. On to your next challenge. Follow me. My Dark Forces are watching you. Yes, keep running into my trap. <laughs> Get them and bring the children to me. Wait. Quickly, quickly. No one. Don't let them escape. I know this place like the back of my hand, so at least we got away, all right? But we won't be safe here much longer. So quickly, your next challenge takes place in the home of this ancient statue. We haven't any time to waste. Quick, gather round, hold on nice and tight. It's off to ancient Egypt. Off we go. Oh, oh, oh goodness me. All right, are we all here? Yeah. One, two, three of you. Phew. So approach. Oh, so quick, quick, quick. Approach. Have we got a challenge What is that noise? I am Cleopatra, Queen of Egypt. Announce yourselves. Harry. Ryan. David. What interesting names you all have. I will give you some statements about our great Egyptian culture. It is for you to decide whether they are true or false. In each of these pots is an asp. It's a tiny, tiny snake with a very sharp bite. If you think the statement is true, then place your hand in the true pot. If you think the statement is false, place your hand in the false pot. If you get it correct three times, you will pass. 
If you get it wrong, you will receive a nasty bite. Get three of those, and you will fail. Are you brave enough to play this game? Yeah, yeah. Well then, let us begin. First statement. True or false? My son inherited my throne after my reign. Is that true or false? We've got to work out if she had a yeah, son. Uh, son. Um, true. Mm, should we go for that? Yeah, true. Go on then, Harry. Approach. It was false. I was the last pharaoh of Egypt and the most magnificent. Let's try another one. In ancient Egypt, a cure for blindness involved mashing up the eye of a pig with honey and red ochre and pouring it into the patient's ear. Tricky one. Uh, false. It is very Can tricky. Go false? That's yeah. Go yeah, let's try it. Go on, right. Are you feeling nervous? No. Are you sure? Yes. Then place your hand deep inside the pot. Oh! <laughs> Unlucky. One more of those and you fail. Next statement. When Ramesses IV was mummified, his eyes were replaced with two small onions. Sounds disgusting. I think it's true. true. You seem very sure. Very well. Put your hand in the true pot. Go on. Correct. That's one right and two wrong. <laughs> Take a seat. The next statement. My burial tomb was only discovered in the 19th century. Well, do any of us know when she died? Mm, no. But I think it's true. What are you going to do? True. Approach. Are you feeling brave, Harry? Yeah. Put your hand in the pot. <laughs> That's three wrong. You have failed. Leave me now. Quick, team, quick. Oh, dear. You know what that means? Only one of you can see the vision. Now, you must decide as a team who that's going to be. They will have to pass on everything they've seen. I don't know, David, you were the only one who got the question right, so you. Do you have a good memory, David? I think so. Got a good memory. Right, in that case, Harry and Ryan, it's back to the museum for you two. Hold on. Now, don't touch anything while I'm gone. I will be back very shortly. Where are we? Fucking museum. So, David, it is all down to you. Now, the whole team is relying on you, OK? No yeah. pressure. Yeah. Secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in. Hold on tight. Close your eyes and see. The vision begins. Ah, oh, we're still in ancient China. And I see the old man, Liu Tingshun. He is making a list of objects for his tomb. Intricate clay figures to serve him in death. Fierce guardians to protect him from evil spirits. Guards to stand watch at the tomb entrance. And horses to ride in the spirit world. He is content. The tomb prepared, he no longer fears death. The image is fading. We're coming back to the museum. Back to the museum. Back to the museum. OK, so that was the second vision. Now, David. You must tell your teammates everything you remember. The Dark Lord could test any one of you in the final battle, OK? What happened? Oh, here are your teammates. Were you all right on your own? Yeah. yeah. Oh, you're ever so brave. So, David, tell them everything that you remember. Um, uh, he was painting symbols 
and he was making horses and at the end he like fell and died. And who is this he? What's his name? Do you Leo remember? Leo Ting Shun. Leo Ting Shun. Very, very well remembered, David. Now, what do you think the relic is that we are seeking? Um, I think it was the horse that he was making to care for him in the underworld, maybe. Ah, the, the little statues yeah. that were placed in his tomb. Maybe you're right. Maybe all become clear in the third and final vision. In the meantime, remember everything David has told you. It will come in very handy when you meet the Dark Lord in the final battle. And remember, you must answer three of his questions correctly to become guardians of the museum and receive the golden scarab. Fail, and it will belong to him forever. Do you understand? Ooh, it's just got colder. Those dark forces must be approaching. We're not safe here any longer. It's on to your next challenge. Follow me, chaps. David has seen the second vision, but will you remember everything he told you? <laughs> well done, chaps. You've survived so far, but the night isn't over yet. You still have one challenge to face and one more vision to see. Your next challenge takes place in the home of this ancient Assyrian obelisk. Are you ready, chaps? Hold on nice and tight, then. You know what to do? Last time. Are you ready? Yeah! Jolly good. Off we go. children. Sorry, I didn't land quite where I thought we were going to. We've got all three of you. Yep. One, two, three. Jolly good. Phew. Sorry about that. Right, now where are we? We must be in Assyria. Now, Assyria is actually part of modern-day Iraq. And what... Oh, look! Oh, look! Oh, what fun! You are in luck. It's wow, the archaeological wow, dig. Wow. Follow me. Now, can any what? of you tell me what an archaeological dig is? No. What's is that? Is it like a mini treasure hunt? It's exactly like a mini treasure hunt. Well done. There is treasure hidden underneath this sand. It is your final challenge to find it. We will take these special archaeological tools. Let me show you. Squeeze in here. Now, watch the technique. You brush away very gently using the brush. Oh, look, look, look. I found something. Look. What is it? What is it? Oh, it's just a rock. Now, how are you with creepy crawlies? Fine. You're fine? Yeah, oh. yeah, of course. Well, you weren't very lucky with the snakes. Let's see how you do with these scorpions. Because it's scorpions, I think you may find, underneath this sand. It's one of the downsides of being an archaeologist, I'm afraid. So, if you find three scorpions, before you find three pieces of treasure, then I'm afraid you've failed, and only one of you will see the vision. We don't However, if you find three pieces of treasure before you find three scorpions, then you have passed, and all three of you can see the vision. Yes. That's what we want for the final battle. Do you think you're ready? Yeah. Do you think you can do it? Yeah. Right. Pick up your tools. Gone in, Ryan. Right, Ryan. Now, you must choose as a team which square is it going to be. Which I one do you think? I think it might be that one because it's near some objects. And then okay. Might... Go on, Em. Go on, Ryan. Gently, gently, one. dust. Keep going. Very gently. All over. <laughs> oh, oh, quickly, cafe away. Oh, goodness oh. me. No. Oh, that's a scorpion. Oh, oh no. dear. That's, oh. a, that's a very oh. disappointing start, oh. isn't it? Yeah. Goodness me. Right. Who's going to go next? David. David. Oh, Dave. Chaps, you might find that map behind you might be useful. Oh, ah. Oh. If the the X's might be um, scorpions. So if there's the so if we go underneath the scorpion, I yeah. think we might find the treasure. treasure. X marks the spot, sort of thing. What, this one? Yes. Oh, oh. here we go. Yes. This is more like yes. it. Yes. Jolly yes. good. Oh, Let jolly me see. Yes. Very good. Yay. Get your trowel at the Yay. ready. Go on, Dave. Treasure. Well done. Jolly good. Lifting it out carefully. Yes. Well done. Pass oh, it to me. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Incredible. What a good find. Let's find another piece of treasure. Oh, this treasure that we're after. I we have thought, one scorpion, one piece of treasure. We need two more pieces I of treasure, thought, please. Because there's a bit of thing there, a bit of thing there. I don't know what they're well, called. Why don't we go for that one? Because yeah, there's, there's treasure. Yeah, because there's three and mm. something, and then there's three with no, a hole. This one So, here? yeah. The end one. Come on, this no, one here. OK. Ooh, yes. Yes. yes! yes! Very well done. Oh, you're on a roll now, chaps. Ooh. Jolly good. Brush it away carefully. Another bracelet, I think. Yeah, it looks like a bracelet. Very gently. Oh, yeah, the sand. Very good. 
Oh, oh, Mostly these. Bracelets. Don't want to damage it, do we? Another bracelet. There we go. It's another bracelet. Yeah. A beautiful one as well. Yeah. Maybe they're a pair. Now, chaps, we only need one more piece of treasure to pass. Oh, OK, but we oh, still want to avoid, the, avoid those scorpions, huh? OK. Go on. Where are you going to we go? We think we're going to go for the top corner, cos there's two bits of treasure. OK. This one was treasure, that one was treasure, so we think that go one Go on, then, be, Ryan, you go for it. Stretch. There's a bit of a pattern here. OK. Yes. Yeah. Oh, don't believe it! Three in a row! Goodness yes. me! Yes, yes. Over to me. Yes. Here we go. Done it. Yeah. Three bracelets. Yes. Very well done. Yes. Let me place this over here. Yes. Come on. Yeah. And you know what that means, team? These you have passed. Yes. 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 And a pat on the back. Jolly good show. Now, all three of you get to see the vision. Now, how do you feel? Brilliant. Yeah, really Fantastic. Well. So we must get into the formation in order to unlock the vision. Two of you over here, one here. So, ankles together, standing up straight. Remember, it only works if you stand up straight. I will do my rhyme, you simply do as I say. Secrets and mysteries we are ready to receive. Deep breath in, hold on tight, close your eyes and see. The vision begins. We're still in ancient China, but the old man is dead. Liu Ting Shun is dead. Sense great sadness. Look, his funeral. There, at the front of the procession, the clay figures. Reflecting his wealth and status as a general of a great Chinese army. They will become known as the Tang Tomb Figures. The tomb shuts. Liu Ting Shun and the figures within. His soul can now journey to the spirit world. The image is fading. We're coming back to the museum, back to the museum, back to the museum. OK, we're back. So that was the third and final vision. So what do you remember, chaps? Um, it was called the Tang Tomb Tomb. Mm -hmm. he, he and his, um, his sculptures were made out of clay. And it was a Chinese army leader of the funeral. He put the um, statues in before they put him in. So what do you think the relic is? I think it's the uh, clay models. The Tang Tomb figures, I think, are the relic that we are seeking. Now, let's just hope you remember enough about the visions to defeat the Dark Lord. And now we must make our final journey to the Great Court to face him. Are you ready to fight the Dark Lord? Yes! Yeah! Yes, jolly good. Then follow me this way. So, all three visions seen. But now, it's time to face me! <laughs> right, this is it, chaps. This is your final battle. Good luck. Now wait here while I summon the Dark Lord. The moon shines bright and darkness reigns. I bring three children here again. Their minds are sharp, the vision's seen. Dark Lord, awake! We challenge thee. Agatha! You bring me three sleepy boys. I can't wait to take them off your hands. Actually, they have done very well tonight. Silence! Do you really think they have the knowledge to beat me? What do you think, chaps? Yeah. Yes. yes! We shall see. Let the battle commence. Three visions you have seen a battle relic held within these walls. I shall ask you questions about what you have seen. Three correct answers will earn your freedom, and you will become guardians of the museum. Three incorrect answers, and you shall never leave. You will become relics yourselves, and remain here for all time. Your first question. Ryan, step forward. Good luck, Ryan. Good, Good luck. Ryan. What position did Liu Tingshun once hold in the army? <laughs> the leader of the Chinese army. Let us see. 
He was once a general of a great army. I'm getting the name Liu Ting Shu. Incorrect. He was a general. Now your teammate belongs to me. <laughs> the Dark Lord has taken Ryan. Just two more incorrect answers, and you'll all belong to him. But you can still do this, chaps. You need three correct answers. Let's see who the Dark Lord is going to summon next. Harry, step forward. Good luck, Harry. Good luck. Leo Tingshin's tomb was filled with objects in preparation for his journey to where? The Underworld. Let us see. His tomb must be filled with everything his soul needs for his journey to the spirit world. Incorrect. It was the spirit world. Now we join Ryan. <laughs> David, you've lost both of your teammates to the Dark Lord, but you can still do yeah. this. Just one more incorrect answer, and you'll belong to him. You need three correct answers to defeat him. Good luck. David, approach. You go, David. Jolly good luck. The Tang Tomb figures were made from what material? Clay. Let us see. Intricate clay figures to serve him in death. You still need two more. Get the next one wrong, and you all belong to me. Your next question. Where in the funeral procession were the Tang Tomb figures placed? Before the coffin was placed in? Let us see. There! At the front of the procession, the clay figures. Oh! I asked where in the procession, not what order they were placed in the tomb. Now you join your friends. No! <laughs> you shall never leave. You will remain here for all time. <laughs> Agatha, you have failed and my darkness reigns supreme. I will return, more children will come. And I will be waiting. <laughs> oh, I can't believe the Dark Lord won. We need more children to fight him. We can defeat him, chaps. Until next time, following on. Journey begins next Saturday at 6.20 on BBC One.